Hello friends, welcome to online study for you. This is Pratik Sirvastava, your placement trainer. Today I am going to discuss few of the surrealism question which has been already asked in AMCAT and E-Litmus exam. So let's understand the amazing trick which will help you to solve the questions within fractions of second without using pen and paper. So let's start with question number one. Question number one a statement is given some bags are hot and all hots are cake and then we have two conclusion all cakes are bags and some bags are cakes so which of the conclusion is true or false that you have to tell from the statement so let's see what we have to do here is see hot and hot is common here so hot and hot you cancel then some plus all now you see here some plus all some plus all will be some so some plus all will be some so you can say some bags are cakes some bags are cakes will be the conclusion so see if we have one conclusion some bags are cakes will be true and the other one will be false so you can very well say only conclusion two follows so see this trick is very much amazing very much unique which will help you to solve the questions within fractions of second and that too without using pen and paper before that we have some formulas kind of thing here which you have to keep in mind i will not ask you to remember this you have to understand and keep in mind so that you will be able to solve the questions quickly right see what we did here we had two statements and then we had been given two conclusions so out of these two conclusions you have to tell if conclusion one follows or conclusion two follows neither conclusion were nor two follows and both one and two follows so what we did hot and hot were the same term so we cancelled it and then sum plus all see here sum is there and here all is there so sum plus all will be equal to sum so sum plus all is sum and sum bags are cakes will be the conclusion so here we can see the conclusion two follows right okay now let's understand what is this formulas and what are the implications see this formula we have to keep in mind to solve the questions see if it is sum plus all all plus no sum plus no sum plus sum all plus all so there are nine combinations are there which we have to keep in mind and as the questions will come i will be explaining each and every formula here right okay and then there are some implications are there what are the implications that we will see see here sum and some we have one implication so what is the meaning see the meaning is when we'll draw a Venn diagram like sum a or b see this is means some part of a is in b and some part of b is in a so if you are saying sum a or b then you can very well say sum b or a if you are saying sum a or b then you can very well say sum b or a so this implication shows that if sum a or b then we can also say sum b or a see in this question see hot and hot will get cancelled then some bags are cakes so if you are saying some bags are cakes then some cakes are bag will be also true so if there is a conclusion conclusion 3 some cakes are bags some cakes are bags then that conclusion will be also true but here we have only one conclusion some bags are cakes so that will be the true conclusion here right so implication means if some a or b then you can also say some b or a if we'll talk about all and some that means if all a or b if all a or b if you are saying all a or b all a or b then you can only say some a or b so this is the implication this is the meaning of this this will understand when the questions will come and then no and no what are the implications see if no a or b then you can say no b or a so this is reversible i mean if no a or b means you can also say no b or a if some a or b then you can also say some b or a if all a or b then we can only say some a or b so as the questions will come i will be explaining each and everything in that questions so let's move to the question number two Let's see the question number two. There are statements all shares are debentures and no debenture is an equity. So here you can see debenture and debenture is a common term. So debenture and debenture will get cancelled, right? And you have to keep in mind that you have to always cancel from right to left. You have to always cancel from right to left. You have to always cancel from right to left. This you have to keep in mind, right? Okay. Now you see debenture and debenture is cancelled then all plus no all plus no is what all plus no is no all plus no is no that you have to keep in mind right okay so all plus no is no so you can say no share no share is equity right okay now you see if you see the implication 
then no is reversible right both side if no a is b then you can also say no b is a so if you are saying no share is equity then you can also say no equity is share so this both the conclusion will be true now check the conclusion no share is equity no share is equity this will be true and then no equity is share then no equity will be also share will be true right see debenture debenture cancelled all plus no is no so no share is an equity because no is reversible in implications so if no share is equity then no equity is share will be also true right okay now let's see the third conclusion some debenture is share now you see debenture and share as given in the first statement right debenture and share is given in the first statement right okay now you see if you'll see in the implications if all a or b if all a or b see all and some has one way implication that means if all a or b then you can say some a or b right then you can say some a or b and if you can say some a or b then you can very well say some b are that already we know right okay so here you see all shares are debentures if all shares are debentures means we can say some shares are debentures or some debentures are share so you see here some debenture is share that will be also true right because all will be Im all implications will be some if some a or b then you can also say some b or a right now let's move to the question number 3 Question number three. The statement is all doctors are surgeons and some chemists are doctor. Right? Okay. So now, if you see, we have to cancel from right to left. Right? But doctor and doctor is the common term. But this is left to right. So we don't have to cancel left to right. We have to always cancel from right to left. Right? Okay. So in this case, what we can do? The first statement I can put below. All doctors are surgeon that's all and now you will be easily able to get the answer from here now doctor and doctor are cancel right okay now some plus all will be what some plus all will be some so some chemist are surgeon so some chemist are surgeon will be the true conclusion right okay now you see the second one all surgeons are chemist so you see some plus all will only give you some some plus all will only give you some so some plus all will be some so some chemists are surgeon is the conclusion one so in this case only conclusion one follows conclusion two will not follow why conclusion two will not follow because they are telling all surgeons are chemist but we are clearly able to see here some plus all is only some so only conclusion one will be following second conclusion will be false right okay now let's move to the question number 4 question number 4 we have three statements and then followed by four conclusion so let's see which conclusion is true now you see folders and folders so folder and folder we get cancel because these are the common terms and we have to cancel always from right to left right okay and then you see box and box will also get cancel so because there are three statements are there and folder folder and box box are common so both will get cancel right okay now you see what are the conclusions are there all folders are drawers so where is folder folder is here and where is drawer drawer is here so folder and drawer we need only these two statement all three statement is not required right okay so now you see box and box will get cancel what is all plus all all plus all will be all so if you'll take statement 2 and statement 3 then all plus all will be all and box and box will get cancel then all folders are drawers right we will get this conclusion and the conclusion number 1 is also same so first conclusion follows right okay now you see all boxes are files all boxes are files so you see folder and folder will get cancel and boxes and boxes will get cancel right okay but here they are telling all boxes are file so boxes are here and file is here right okay so basically we need a statement 1 and a statement 2 we don't need a statement 3 see statement 1 and 2 is enough to answer the conclusion number 2 so conclusion number 3 we will not touch now right okay so boxes and file so box is here and file is here so folder and folder you cancel then all plus all will be what all plus all will be all then we can write all files all files are boxes this conclusion will be true but if you'll see their conclusion is all boxes are files so this may be true or may be false that we have to see from here right so what conclusion we have got all all files are boxes so if you see if all is there 
then we can only say sum a or b or sum b or a if all files are boxes means we can only say sum files are boxes or sum boxes are some boxes are files so in this case conclusion 2 will become wrong because the position of box and file are different right okay let's move to the third conclusion all files are drawers so file is here and drawer is here so see folder and folder will get cancelled boxes and boxes will get cancelled now all plus all will be what all plus all will be all so you see all plus all will be all so we'll write all here right okay again all plus all will be what all plus all will be again all and these two are cancelled so what you will get we will get all files are drawers so if you are getting the same conclusion and if the conclusion is there in the conclusion list then conclusion 3 will be also correct so all files are drawers is also correct right okay now the fourth conclusion is all drawers are folders so drawers is here and folder is here right okay so box and box will get cancelled all plus all will be all so we can only say all folders all folders are drawers will be the true conclusion right okay but here they are telling all drawers are folders which will become false because what we have got is all folders are draws right so here only conclusion one and conclusion three will be correct so i hope you understood all the four questions and the amazing trick associated with that if you have any doubt then please comment below so that i will be able to clarify your doubt thanks a lot for watching the video